And there we go. Ryan Smith wins it, gets this postseason underway. Now it's Borgula. Steps on side, drops it along. He absorbs a big check. And we continue. Back behind the net. Stampede will locate it. Across the ice it goes as Lacroix throws a check. Long shot there and a save made by Mann. Storm starting to pressure the Stampede netminder. On this Monday night, three-game series, best of three. And the winner, as I mentioned earlier, in the VR Wireless pregame show will advance to play the Fargo Force. Defensive line up there at the top of the screen, 16-45. Left to play in period one, just underway tonight. Storm trying to finish some checks across the ring. 13.54 to play in the first period. Here comes Sioux Falls, two on one, Lapenta drags it, fires, and Cameron Corpy makes a nice save at the top of the goal crease. Charlie Kensman searching for it, didn't get it the first time, and then took it away on the second effort. Rossi will try to find it, and across the zone he goes. Artemi Nizamayev. He curls and looks to go back behind. Eventually, Lukashevich is open, fires, and man, sees it go into the corner. Storm on side now, looking to take the lead, but it's intercepted by the Stampede. they got to play up the center ice with Weebush, taken away by McEwen and Constance. So the Storm's line of defense there, just around the blue line, able to get it back. Fans don't like to take yellow McEwen, and they fire and score with McNeilis. It's 1-0, and the Storm fans upset, and it looks like it's a goal. 10.39 to play in the first period, and Sioux Falls has made it 1-0. Behind the line, near side, wide open, Lukashevich across one more time. Kensman fires, save, maybe there's a rebound there. And Mann's able to keep it out of the back of the goal, and the Stampede will find it, and they'll move it down the ring. Big hit there in front of the Storm bench, Charlie Kensman. But they've put together some really good games against this opponent this year. Waved down along the near side. Look out, Borgula's got it down low off the backhand. Same in by Corpy. Big rebound. They score, and it's 2-0. And the Stampede make a statement here on the road in the first period. Chase LaPenta has given Sioux Falls a two-goal lead. Here's Rossi. They go across the ice to Lukashevich. Also assisting number. Lukashevich on side here. Makes a good move in front of the backhand. They fire and score. Tipped in. And it's 2-1. Nolan Rowe to score the Storm's opening goal of the postseason. Zabs, we mentioned the adversity face. That's how you respond right there. Yeah, that's a big time response. We definitely needed that. Huge bounce back shift for us. Get this thing back to 2 1. Could help us get a little momentum going. Here we go. August Balloon. Onside. In front he goes. There's a rebound there. Given up by Manns. And I don't know if he had it covered, but they gave him the whistle anyway. And what a chance there. One minute left to play in period one. One minute left in the first period. Stampede have it down low. Good save made there by Cameron Corpy. Not an easy play, but one that he had to deal with. Just along the red line at center now. There's a takedown on Harper the fans don't like. Sioux Falls onside late. A shot and a save. And that may do it for the first period. There's one second left. Each team has returned. They switched into the building, and here we go. The second period is underway. Dry City back to it here. This will be Sean McEwen, near side of Smith. He's open, shooting it. Good shot, but a nice save made by Christian Mann. Storm searching for it. They'll find it here with Rossi. He could have a rush. Long shot. Big rebound given up by Manns. As the Storm looked to tie the game here in the second period. Played along by the Stampede. Onside look out here. Wide open in front, and a good save made. By Cameron Corpy on Hunter Anderson. Out towards center. Here we go. Ryan Smith and Isamay have quick shot and a nice save made by Christian Mann. They'll take it in the corner with LaPenta. Chase LaPenta committed to Arizona State. Blocked in front. Got his own rebound. Fires and scores. What a goal there. And it's 3 to 1. 15 19 left to go in the second period. Two on two, McNeilis on side. Top of the circle, drops it along. They fire, and I think that got the post. Almost went in the back of the goal. Stays out, though. I think that barely touched the iron. And they'll search for it. No one with it yet. Now the Storm have it out in front. They try to take it off the back end. The goal's off. Storm have it. Near side, road, from, road to Rossi. Now it's Simpson back to Rossi. Open shooting, it scores! 3-2, Jake Rossi! And once again, the Storm down by just a goal. Yeah, big time goal there for us. Get a little momentum here to finish out the period. Rossi's had some good looks tonight. I've actually been impressed with his game. It's nice to see him get rewarded, but huge goal to get this thing to 3-2. So 
Tri-City with Steenerson throwing a hit. On the other side, though, here come a stampede. Collected back behind the goal. He's got 2.21 to play in the first and the second period. Stormed down by one. And three to two. Kensman finds it here. Look out. Across they go. They score! August Balloon from Charlie Kensman. Tie game here in the second period. It's three to three with 2.12 left to go. And the captain, Balloon, buries one. In the final four minutes. They'll stretch one out to center here, trying to find a play up to A.J. Lacroix. Big hit from him. The fans will like that. But now the Storm got to get back here. Two on one, maybe a three on one. Across the other fire and score. It's four to three. Stampede take the lead back. 128 left to go. In the second period, he might have got that one, but I think it was collected in front of him. Storm had Rozzi wide open in front of the goal. They fire one right there, and Manns makes a great save with a right pad. Troy City center that back, and they had the play. Ryan Smith gets us going. Charlie Kensman, Vlad Lukashevich, August Balloon, Artemi Nizamayev all on the ice to begin. And the Hilltop Bowl, third period. Dry City searching for it. They'll find it with Falloon. Good pass to find Nizamayev. Here he is up the left wing. Across they go in on goal. The man's made a great save. And they couldn't do anything with a rebound. Rukinakis. He's still fighting for it. Bouncing away now. McEwen got taken down there in front of the goal. Fans wanted a call. We keep playing. Still with it here. And he's got it, down low, trying to go out in front to Smith. It was blocked, rebounds there, they're searching for it. They fire another one, Mans makes a save. And it's out to center. Our timid is a may have a long shot. This one goes well wide and out of play. 13-36, left to go in the Hilltop Mall, third period. Nizamayev goes down, and the opening game of the playoffs. They win the faceoff here. Quick shot, right off the crossbar it goes. And it's free, in on goal again. And Mans makes a save as he pushes the goal off. In front they go, back behind the net, they try to put it in. And Briere had it, charging back down the ring, trying to find it. Nearing wants it, they zip one in, and a good save made by the pads of Cameron Corpy. 11.47 to play in the third period, stormed down by one. Simpson settles it. He waits, finds Lukashevich in on goal, and Mans makes a save on him. They center again, looking for it, and it's fouled by the Stampede. Great vision, Cooper Simpson, to move that puck all the way across to find Lukashevich, who has some offense to his game. Here they go again, in front road, across they fire and score! Try City Storm! It's the second of the night for Jake Rossi. And well wide of the goal. They'll find it with McEwen again, though. Fires again. Big rebound. Steenerson in front they go. That time it got behind Mans. It went out the other side, but they miss. Here come the stampede, though. On side, they center. And a good stick there by Vlad Lukashevich. That might have prevented the goal. And they try to pass down low with Cooper Simpson. Owen Road with it. Those two players have had great games as well. Rossi's out there. So now we see a push from Sioux Falls. Charlie goes in front of the goal here. In on goal. A save made by the pad of Corpy. A tie game at four. Two minutes left to go. Storm Steel here with Simpson. Here he comes. He's in on a break off the forehand. Shut down. It's free. And the net's off. Stampede go, to go across with Panzer. They give the pass. Collision in the corner. Storm to it with Lucas Shavich, just over a minute to go in regulation. And the Storm up the wing with it. Falloon is struggling to leave the ice here, Kensman rather. And it looks like he'll be able to move across. He's really in pain. Now a break to win the game. Borgula in. Shoot scores. Under a minute to play. And with Kensman struggling to leave the ice, a break from the blue line in on goal. And that might do it. Five to four, 58 seconds left. Man, I don't know if I've ever seen anything like that, Kenny, where the ref's helping the defenseman yep. get off the ice. Quick up breakaway. Man, just a crazy sequence, so we're going to need to buckle down here, last push. McNeilis, across they go, and they fail the shot, and they slam it off the side of the post. It's out of the neutral zone. Sioux Falls has it. They're going to try to kill the clock and pull it back in the zone with Sobieski. This is all over the place. Now it's on side for the Storm. Stampede have it, they clear, not out. Seven seconds towards the net, tipped in, 
Jake Rossi, hat trick. Oh my goodness, I do not believe this. I do not believe what I've just seen. True craziness, heroics, 5-5. Five, five. Wow, wow. I'm not gonna lie, Kenny, I wasn't overly confident there when that was just kind of a broken play at the blue line. Just a great effort by Ross to get to the net, throw the pucks there, good things happen. We're setting up for a crazy finish in overtime. I've just never seen anything like that. They've had goals similar to this and, and late in the game and this season. I, I just don't remember one quite like that. There's the face off at center ice. And game one of the playoffs, we're going to overtime. There we go. Overtime is underway. Lukas Javich, then it's given away. One timer high in the zone. Shot block, it's out. And this is into the glove of Corpy is rolling just by the net minor man's. Back it up on edge. And then a high stick will be called the Cambriere. 133 to kill off here. Sobieski across they go, looking to win it. They dish it down low. They look to fire it on goal. They do it again. And Cameron Corpy ready for it. Another one. And the goal is open there after he makes a save. Borgula has it. Near side. Look out here. They shoot it in front again. It's blocked. Corpy's running to his way out of the crease. Storm clear it. Could be trouble here. Three on two in the overtime. Stampede onside. Long shot. Rebound given up though by Corpy. And they'll pull it back behind his goal. Nice and he's to it here. Could be a three on two. They've got it on side in the overtime. They fire one and the save made by Manns. Here's Road in the corner. High they go to Constance. Across to Lukashevich. Far side circle. They fire one. And the net comes off as Manns makes the save. And it goes to Rossi. On side here. Simpson in front. They're going to play the road. And on goal. Shut down by Manns. So Lacroix's got to work to get back. Near side. They swing it across. On side. Borgula. Long shot. Tipped right in on goal. And Cameron Corpy's there. In front, they go with it. They couldn't fire. High in the zone. They'll try a long play. Now back down behind the goal line. Stampede wanted the penalty. They're going to get one. Leans over. Looks to win it. High in the zone. They'll hold the line with Matthew Grimes. Grimes has it. They go across. Down low here. In on goal. And they score. And they win it. 6-5 to five the final. The Stampede score the overtime game winner.